Hey guys. Welcome to couple. Please like and subscribe if you like this video. Apparently all Michael Cohen had to do to lose Fox News was sit down with ABC's George Stephanopoulos. Following an off-camera interview in which Cohen pledged his loyalty not to President Trump but to his family and his country, the hosts of Fox's Outnumbered came down hard on the full-time fixer and sometime lawyer, openly questioning his credibility ahead of his potential cooperation with two separate investigations into the president. Delivering a major understatement, Harris Faulkner noted that Cohen seems to be creating some daylight between himself and Trump, for whom he once suggested he would take a bullet. Going against the president, Cohen told Stephanopoulos that he doesn't think Robert Mueller's Russia investigation is a witch hunt and said that he trusts the intelligence community's unanimous conclusions about Russia's meddling in the 2016 election. If he knows something that is so important and yet he's willing to sort of taunt the president by seeming to go against him, what does that say about this person as a witness? Faulkner wondered aloud. It gets difficult to kind of even see him as credible at this point. I don't know what he knows, just based on the way he's acting. Later, she added, the one thing we know about Michael Cohen is that he'll throw anybody under the bus. Faulkner pointed to the moment in court when Cohen gave up Fox News' own Sean Hannity as his mystery third client. Beyond simply giving Fox News' biggest star legal advice, Cohen was a frequent guest on the network for years. Before he hinted that he might flip on the president, he was a welcome and trusted Trump surrogate on Fox. And if you're willing to give an interview, if you're willing to speak out publicly like he's now done and go against the president, co-host Abby Huntsman concurred, I think we should all take that as a signal that he is in a dire situation, grasping for air, wanting any help he can get. When Juan Williams noted that the one area Cohen refused to discuss was the hush payments to Stormy Daniels, Faulkner added, that's why I question his credibility, because what are his motives?